everyone. Today I'm going to be reviewing this Hoover FH50150 Carpet Basics Power Scrub Deluxe Carpet Cleaner. Um, this has exclusive spin scrub technology, 360 degree cleaning, gently loosens dirt and cleans all sides of carpet and upholstery fibers. Um, it has a dual tank on it. Uh, one side is for your water. Um, and then the other side is for the, um, the cleaning solution. Um, there it goes. Uh, this is his solution on it. And then, um, it has rinse and wash. And then, um, this is the reservoir that holds all the dirty water. Um, this unit is, uh, Pretty lightweight, it weighs less than 19 pounds. It has four easy to access handles for easy transport. Um, and it comes with a mess, a mesh tool storage bag, which has inside like a hand, uh, a powered hand tool, stair tool, upholstery tool, crevice tool. And it also comes with 16 ounces of solution just to kind of start you off with. Um, and it says it has an automatic detergent mixing system, which provides the correct mix of detergent and water for optimum cleaning results. So um, I am going to um, use this on um, our son's floor, and I'll kind of show you as I'm as I'm using it, and um, I'll post like before and after pictures. But um, I use this last night on a test patch in our living room and it worked pretty well it got a stain that was on the floor um for a while it, it got it up you know fairly easily so so far i'm pretty impressed with this um this was very easy um to unbox and it was super easy to put together um pretty much all you had to do was snap a, a couple pieces together so um, I was glad that there really wasn't a whole lot, uh, as far as assembly. Um, there are, it did come with two screws that, um, once you fit, um, this piece, like the handle piece, once you fit the handle piece on, there, there are screws in here on each side that you had to, of course you can't see them from here really, but... You had to screw those in and um, that was it as far as like any hardware type type thing so um, it's got this is the handle release or you know makes it tilt backwards and then that is the power switch and both of which are very easy to get to so um, like I said I'm going to try this out in our son's room and I will show you how it works um, I just wanted to show you the bag that I was talking about that comes with this set. Um, it is a mesh bag and it also has a hanger on it so you can use it um, like in a laundry room or a spare closet or if you have a closet just for you know cleaning supplies um, you can just hang it hang it up um, and then it has a this button. Uh, it just snaps back, and then inside it has different tools. All right, um, these are the dif the different tools that come with it. Um, it has you know different attachments, like if you want to clean upholstery and things like that, and it has like a crevice tool as well. Um, and then here is the, it has a couple of these. I haven't unpackaged them yet. I just actually um, opened the box a couple of nights ago. So um, it has the, these three and then the crevice tool. And then uh, it has this hose for like if you want, it, it's for the, you know, upholstery and everything. So um, I really like how these tools come in a, mesh bag like this or just a bag in general where you can hang it up and it's not just 
you know, miscellaneous pieces that you got to find a place for. So it's really great that they, um, you know, thought of the consumer and, you know, had something to keep them in. So I really like that aspect of, um, of this, um, of this machine that I bought. Uh, now I'm going to show you how to um, empty the reservoir that holds all of um, the dirty water that's pulled up out of the carpet. So um, <clears throat> after you detach it from the base of the, um, of the steam cleaner, um, all you have to do then is open this part right here. You just unlatch it and this will come off. And, um, I usually, you know, I kind of set this piece off to the side and I do rinse it a little bit as well. Um, <clears throat> and then I just dump this water in my sink and I'm just going to kind of show you, I mean, this water is, it's got some dirtiness to it, definitely, um, like I said, our house is a year and a half old. So, and I, I vacuum, I'd say, at least every week, sometimes twice a week. But even with vacuuming that much, like, I mean, this is pretty gross. So, you see all that the residue and stuff coming up off the bottom that is settled. It's pretty gross. So, as you can see, it definitely gets um, <clears throat> the dirt and uh, nastiness off the floor. So, so I, I definitely say um, that this product definitely works. Um, this is my second time using it, so. Um, uh, you know, so far I'm pretty impressed. All right, I'm back, uh, with this, you know, where it's been dumped and cleaned out and everything. And this is really easy to, um, attach back onto the base of your steam cleaner. All you do is line up everything and it snaps into place. And then all you have to do is put this latch back where it was at. And then you just pull this back up. So um, now I am ready to go again where I can make some more. Um, I've done most of my son's room so far and it looks a lot better. I'll put a before picture um, of what his carpet looked like. Again, it doesn't look dirty at all, but um, you know, I really wanted a steam cleaner because we just got this house. You know, about a year and a half ago, and I just want to make sure that we take care of our carpet. So I thought this would be a really great machine that would do that without me having to pay someone a hundred bucks or so to come in every six months and do it or whatever. So, um, you know, like I said, their carpet is is pretty clean to begin with. So um, this will be really good just to keep up with on maintenance of our carpet. So. Um, I'm going to turn this back on um, and start making some passes with this in, um, in this. I've already done the closet, so really all I've got is this area right here to do, and, which kind of leads me out of here. So um, the first thing you want to do is turn it to um, wash right here so um and once you turn it to wash that is the part that actually spits out the cleaner the cleaner smells really good the cleaner that came with this so i'm definitely going to buy some more of the hoover brand cleaner uh, anyway to to start it again um i would just do the handle release on it and it's a little bit slippery from where I've been using it. And then um, 
the power button is down here. So whenever you are making um, passes with this, there is a lever right here where you, you pull this in to, um, to wash and rinse the carpet. And then after you, like you do a sweep of, um, of washing the carpet back and forth, and then you do a sweep of rinsing the carpet back and forth. And then once you're done with that, you just let off this handle and um, go back over it again. It helps suck out um, any of the, the liquid that's kind of still on your floor. So I'm going to um, go ahead and do that now. So it is on the wash setting, which is what we need. And I'm going to turn it on. And press the handle. Okay, now I'm going to switch it to the rinse and rinse the carpet. And when you rinse it, you obviously have to pull this trigger down to release um, the clean water. So it still looks like I've got um, some left in there to rinse. Okay, um, now that I'm done rinsing the carpet, I am going to pull up any excess water by just running the machine and not, you know, don't press in this handle or anything. That I went back over it um, with the drying feature you know you're, you're not pushing down the handle you're just pulling excess water out of the carpet um, <clears throat> I did do that a couple more times than I did the the wash and the rinse um, just to kind of get the carpet pretty dry so um, last night I did a test patch in our living room um, like maybe like a three foot by three foot area and I think I did it maybe around 9 and I went to bed around 12 or 1 I believe and that small area was pretty dry so um, I did my son's room he's at school right now um, so I'd say you know right now it's um, I think it's about 10 or 11 o'clock in the morning so by the time he gets home from school his uh, carpet will be pretty much um, not if not fully dry it'll be pretty dry for him to even you know come in here and play so um, I really I recommend this uh, device I you know at first I've you know, I was kind of um, I had never used one before and I actually I got this probably two weeks ago and you know, I kind of was lazy about putting it together because I thought it was going to be, you know, more work than it really was. Like, it, it went together really easily. I had it put together in, I'd say, less than five minutes. So, um, you know, don't let, um, let it overwhelm you or anything. This is a really easy um, machine to use and... I, I'm really, I'm excited to have this, especially after seeing, like, what it pulled out of his carpet, 
you know, when I clean as much as I do. So, um, it definitely got a lot of dirt out of the carpet. And we, like, we do not even wear our shoes in the house. Like, you know, with the new house, we, everybody takes their shoes off at the door. And, you know, it still pulled a lot of stuff out of the carpet. So, I'm very pleased with this unit. And, um, if you are in the market for buying, um, a new um, a new to replace one or just to have one like this is I think that this is a you know Hoover is a pretty um, trusted brand so um, I would definitely recommend this so um, I hope that this review was helpful to you um, and if you have any questions about this this model or anything you know feel free to leave me a comment and I will answer it the best that I can but um I really hope you enjoyed my review and thank you so much for watching.